Okay, today we're going to show you how to replace the CR-10S extruder. First, you're going to need a replacement extruder and the Allen key part of the tool kit. To start with, you remove the locking nut here and take the plug out, like so. Next, you remove the PTFE tube or Bowden tube from the motor. Push in and pull back. Next, we remove these two hex keys to remove the cover from the fan extruder housing. Now we left the fan housing back and set it on the rail as, I see, as you see. And now we have to remove two more screws to remove the extruder from the printer. Be careful not to lose any of the screws. Now, that is the extruder removed from the printer. Now we're going to do it in reverse order and install a new extruder. First, we put the extruder on and put one of the two long screws through Now we get the second screw in And make sure they're done up nice and tight. Not too tight. And we put the wires to the right hand side of the extruder. Now we cover it with the fan housing and fans. Be careful when you're putting in these very small screws because you can last them very handy. Tighten them up tight, not too tight. Now we put the PTFE tube or Bowden tube back in on the new extruder and plug in the plug again on the top and screw on the locking ring just hand tight 
does not have to be extremely tight. Now, that is a extruder replaced on a CR10S. All you have to do now is go into the menu and check and make sure that the that the nozzle is heating up again and everything is working as it should. Thank you.